Well, hello, y'all. We finna do it again. We finna do a reading for my Geminis. How y'all doing for April? Don't mind the baby cover. I had to put something over my body so I won't feel naked, which I ain't naked. But anyway, I want to tell y'all thank you for joining me, and this is for Geminis, okay? Let's do your reading. Let's see what you're going to be doing in April. April... Let's see what moon phase is going on. What's going on in the moon phases? What's going on with my lovely Gemini? And how you doing? I hope everybody doing fantastic. It's lovely out in these streets, ain't it? You got to have fun. You don't, yeah, you got to learn to live. You live once and you learn. And if you don't like turtle, then what you doing here? Because I don't want you mad at me. I want to tell you thank you and I love you and I send love and light to everyone. And I appreciate for y'all stopping or just checking a girl out. Okay? Here we go. What is the going to be the first week of April? The energies that we're going to have to be facing with my Geminis. What are they going to have to be facing? What energy on the first week? First week. What energies are they going to have to be facing on the first week of uh, April to the end of the month? We'll start with four cards. It's all we need. What's going to be going down the first week? The first week we have, it says the full moon in Leo. Don't let your pride get in the way of doing what you're supposed to do. Gemini. Okay. Second week, what's going to be going down? What energies we're going to have to deal with the Geminis. And y'all please like, subscribe, stop being so tight about the dial. I appreciate it. Yep, me out. Two came out. We have the Gibbons Moon. You're very close to achieving your goal. You're very close to achieving something. And it says the third quarter moon adjustments are required. Okay, uh, third week. What's going to be going down? The third week we have... I'm just going to take the one on the bottom. It says, Void of course, Moon. Nothing will come of this, this situation. Okay, last week. What's going to happen on the fourth week? One card, please. What happened in the fourth week? One card. One card, Spirit, please. No, two turned over. Don't. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, uh, the first one was, it says in the full moon of cancer, a personal issue reaches resolution in the fourth week of April. And then it says uh, the full moon in Aries of Flurry Comics is approaching. So you, oh, Aries month, happy birthday, first of all, in Aries. So if it's your birthday, you know, shiny like 1999. Let's do it. Mm -mm. Let's do it. <laughs> hey, age is a blessing. You remember, every day ain't promised. Age is a blessing. That's why I'm looking at it now. To be here is a blessing. All the stuff we having to deal with. It's a blessing. Okay, let's get started here. Okay. Okay, Spirit, tell me what what do you have? We're going to use the tea leaves. Um, first week of April, what do you want to tell my lovely, fantastic Geminis the first week? What's the advice for the first week? What's going to be going on if they don't see coming the first week in the tea leaves? First week of April. We have purse. Pay attention to your finances. They want you to pay attention to your finances. And the second week, they want you to what? What's going on the second week? Okay, dogs. It says getting together with friends. The second week, some of you may be getting together with people the second week. The third week. Star. The third week, you got the star guaranteed success. You're guaranteed some success on something you're working on. Okay? In the fourth week, 
Anything you want to say about the fourth week of April for my lovely, fantastic Gemini's? Fourth week of April. I want to say, Lily, spiritual love. Someone is sending you Lily, Lily spiritual love. Oh, someone sending you flowers. What I heard from heaven. Okay. Now, let's get. Watch, excuse my nails. I should have. I got them growing back. But, you know, that was a mess. Okay. Let's get the kipper out of here. What's the clarification? In the first week, you have the purse. Um. Why is don't let your pride get in the way in money and purse? What do they need to know for the first week? What could possibly be happening for my lovely Gemini's on the first week of April? They're just moving along. I'm doing just, just months of just going fast, ain't they? What's going on? What's going to be happening in the first week of uh, April for my Gemini's? Thief. I got the thief card out. Why is thief? What else could be going on? No, oh, we're not gonna take this one. This one okay, okay. Why is the thief here? Who's the thief? Why is don't let your pride get in the way? Why is don't let your pride get in the way? There's a some of you may have somebody is stealing something. Time it could be still um, a privileged lady. Might be expecting too much. That's what I'm hearing. Kind of expecting too much. Okay. The second week. What's going on down the second week here? Spirit. What's going to be happening the second week for my lovely. Um, this going to be all over the place, y'all. For my lovely Geminis. What else? Why is getting together with friends here for the second week? Be careful for burglaries and stuff like that. Come on. The second week. What's going to be happening that they don't see coming the second week for my Geminis? We have false person. Um, there's a false person in your life. They're not being on the up and up with you, Gemini. So you need to be aware of there's a, uh, a false friend that you may be going around at that time of that get together. Um... Spirit, what goal is... What's, what's it say? You you will be with achieving a goal. Why is the star card here for the third week? Why is it star card here for the third week? What's going on here for the third week of April? Oh, a gift. Someone's getting a gift of great success and a house. Somebody's... Uh, Somebody's trying to give a gift of a house is because it's in the reverse. So that's in the in the future. Some Gemini is working on that looks like a great fortune and maybe a house be given to you. Yeah, it's a house because it's a gift. Okay, what's going on in the fourth week? So some of you have a gift coming in the fourth. Could be a coffin. Okay, we have the coffin here. We also have spiritual love. There's someone sending you love. And 
I think this is from someone from the past because this is past tense. Someone from past tense that has passed away is sending you uh, lilies to you. Why is this coffin here? Okay. Why is this coffin here, spirit? Okay. Okay. See, this is uh, from way back. Someone, the coffin is a message that you get from someone from way back. It was a message that this person had someone passed and they they're sending you um on the other side they're sending lilies to you <clears throat> spiritual love and what is personal issues reads a resolution what is personal issues on the fourth week res resolution okay occupation Yeah, someone reaches resolution about the occupation of what they're going to end up being doing. Uh, they're working on that. Why is a flurry climax approaching? Why is flurry climax approaching for Aries in the fourth week of April? Oh, because, yeah, it's going to get hot and heavy. On the fourth week, lovers are going to be hot and heavy on the fourth week. You're going to be doing a lot of that. Um, and some of you, okay, is there anything else that they don't see coming? What else do you want to tell them? What's the, what is the outcome of this relationship? What's the outcome of this, the lovers? Who is the lover's outcome? What is the outcome of uh, Gemini lovers? What is the outcome to the lovers here? What's going to be the outcome to the lovers? Okay. In other words, yeah. You need to choose your path. That's just up to you. You need it's to, it's, you have to choose the path for love, to get love. You're going to have to choose the path. Yep, you're going to have to choose the path. You need to choose your pathway, which what you want to, which your pathway, where you want your relationship to go. It's a choice in April. Um, but just watch out. You also have this problem with thievery in the first week. Because somebody could rob you or try something to do with... Um, or this privileged lady is taking a lot of your time and taking a lot of uh, stealing energy um, but this person is uh, they need to make some adjustments I'll tell you that okay let's see what the wheel of fortune got for you okay what do you want to tell them month of April. What advice you got for the in four cards? What do you want to tell them for the month of April 2022 in four cards? What's going to happen? What advice you in four cards you give my lovely Geminis for the month of April? There's one. The first one it says you are missing many opportunities. Take advantage of it. They want you to take advantage of your opportunities because you're missing out on a lot of opportunities. Um, then it says here, uh, regardless of the opposition, you will be successful. Regardless of what goes down, you will be successful. Let's see. Third week. What's going on for the third week? What message? Looks like somebody's going to be getting a gift of a house or something. Or trying to get one. It's in the future for some uh, Geminis. Successful in big things if undertaken you will be successful when you take on big things that's what they want you to know Gemini when you take on big things you will be successful it says wealth inherited from an unexpected quarter 
There is wealth coming to you from an unexpected quarter, as they're saying. What's going on in the fourth week of that you want to say? Um, hasty news. There's going to be some hasty news coming to you on the fourth week. Okay. Okay, Spirit. What is the hasty news that Gemini is going to hear on the fourth week? I'm looking at the time, y'all, so if y'all want to know what I'm doing. What is the hasty news on the fourth week? Here. What is the hasty news that uh, Gemini may hear on the fourth week? What is the hasty news that Gemini may hear on the fourth week? the hasty news what's the hasty news that Gemini's may hear on the fourth week what's the hasty news there's too many what's the hasty news Gemini's may hear on the fourth week hasty news what's going on here with the hasty news one part spirit hasty news what are they going to hear hasty news what are Gemini's going to hear on the fourth week is hasty news. Okay. There is a... There's going to be a tower. The tower came out for some hasty news. Um... Some hasty news, Gemini. Uh, there will be... A, there's a tower... There will be justice for this news. Then you have the Six of Swords just sitting up there in battle trying to stand your ground. Why is the Six of uh, Swords is that Six of Well, that's Five of Swords. Sorry, y'all. Why is the Five of Swords it's like you're retreating from something. Yeah, five of swords, just as you retreat. Why is the five of swords here for Gemini? Why is the five of swords here for Gemini? Why is the five of swords here for Gemini? Okay. You're starting to come out of that where you couldn't, the four of cups, that you couldn't see the cups because it was the reverse. So it looks like you decided to retreat from it and you're coming out of that and you left it alone because you're not trying to be like your blessings get destructive because of that. So whatever happened, you're not going to, you're just going to blow it off the top because it's the best thing to do. It ain't worth it. Outcome to the situation on the board of April. What's the outcome to the, what's on the board? Outcome. Look like it will not be no victory. Knight of Wands, someone comes with to you. It looks like it won't be no victory over something. That hasty news, it won't be a victory over it. Whatever that is, it's, it's not going to be all that. Okay. Let's see. Relationship. What advice on relationship? What do you want to tell? What advice you give my lovely Gemini's about relationships? So you can express a lot of things. Watch out, but don't be giving all your energy away to people that don't serve you know, your greatest good. Watch out for false people trying to be your friend. Gemini. They're not on earth enough. Okay, what message do you have for relationship, for their relationship? What messages you have for relationship for April? What messages for April for Gemini? Okay, we have the first one. It says finances and a career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. There's financial issues going on. 
in April could be a problem with your love life. What else that causes problems? Even though it says not, but it, you know, it's, it's just watch your finances real close. Especially since all going on. That's too many cards. They all want to fall. Three more cards, please. Just three more. One. Two. One more. Three. Okay. Here we go. The first one that came out was, it says, give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. You need to learn how to work on your partnership with the one that you care about and you adore or you love. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honesty. Discuss your feelings with each other. It says religion factors. Your love life is being influenced by religion factors. Okay? Well, that was your reading for April. Hope you enjoyed it. Come back and journal, girl. And pick up the phone and stop acting like you don't know nobody. Because I love y'all. I love you. Send love and light to you. Have a good April gonna be bombing. Just be safe. Just sorry. Watch out for anybody that want to dog take trick that. It's time to enjoy your life. It's short. Nothing's promised for a long time. So it's either we wake up or we stay asleep. And I'm not doing it. So if you want to wake up or you want to stay asleep, that's up to you, Gemini. And that was your reading for Gemini. So I'm finna hang up. <laughs> bye bye I love y'all push the dial like share and subscribe please